Yes, yes. Hello, guys. Hello, everyone. Welcome back again to this video, and welcome back again to No Max TV. Uh, so, in today's video. I'm going to be showing you how you can reduce the internet usage at your computer at least 90% uh, of the internet user at your computer and you can be reducing it today. So this uh, video I'm going to be showing you is from my experience that I have been facing. Uh, also, I used to be uh, uh, using my own internet, either tethering uh, via my mobile phone, also either by using any other router, either by connecting it to a Wi-Fi or wireless connection. But I used to be uh, saying that uh, it was uh, consuming a lot of internet on my computer. I used to be also buying my own internet on my phone and within like 10 minutes or 3 minutes it is going to be uh, finishing. So I remember uh, once I, I had uh, 15 GBs or gigabytes on my, of the internet on my Android phone and once I fettered to my computer within uh, at least five minutes I, I want to see that you, my internet was already uh, finished but I asked myself why what is happening and also uh, I learned to find a solution to find what is causing it in you know, my computer because that time even it was like that I was not using my computer I was not watching any video it was only connected I was not on the internet so by asking myself why or how can 15 GB of the internet uh, goes or finish within uh, six or five minutes so I was asking myself what is the issue and also i decided to explore and see what is causing it in my computer i got there in my computer and navigated it with the various options and also uh come with the solution so i take the solution like uh, three months later and now i'm coming with this video to be able to show you how it can be even helpful for you i'm sure that by watching this video or by applying this technique I have applied, now you can reduce the internet you use by 90% on your computer. So now I'm going to be showing you the process and I want to be showing you, I will be telling you the reason why that internet can be uh, going or so finishing fast on your computer uh, because a uh, in computer is using it in various ways that you're not aware. So what you do? You see, and I'm on my computer. Also, if you are not on your computer, you need to be uh, finding out the setting option of your computer. If either are using Windows 10, it's the same way. Find the setting option of your computer, and also find an option which is called Windows updates. As you see, I have various options. I have a network and internet. I have personalization. I have a Windows and update here. If I want to be opening the setting option of your computer, I'm going to be getting various options on of your computer. So that you can be navigating there. So now open the Windows update. After opening the Windows update, you can see now I'm now on this background, and this is where I'm going to be also uh, dealing with this case. What I do, you see now uh, my uh, update are paused. So now let me try to resume this update. So if I try resuming this update, you see now I have connect already connected my internet, and now it is fettered. Now let me also try resuming the applet. After resuming the applet, which means that my applets in the, the computer are going to be starting working, which means the software are going to be uh, starting updating themselves, which means also uh, the, the other versions of the software are going to be updating themselves in my computer. Also, it can uh, be bringing the recommendations that I can be starting to be doing. As you see now, after now uh, resuming it, you see now Ablet available today. You see now it already start downloading. This means that uh, this is the one which is now also consuming my internet here. So this one is downloading and also I didn't initiate it. This one is downloading. I did not initiate it. You see now it is on 1%. This one is downloading. I did not initiate it also of course. Which means if this one is finished downloading, there are other applets that may be coming and will start downloading on my computer. So what I recommend to you is that to be able to uh, retrieve from this issue is that you know that now these softwares which are updating all these systems in my computer are the ones which are going to be consuming high internet and you are not thinking about this. So what the, uh, the strategy I used to do uh, here is that I used to pause this one in the meantime and I used to take time. For example, I can be taking like one day within a month and also open doors 
when uh, i'm planning to be having also uh, now uh, an internet connection which is uh, uh, enough so that i can be update everything that i want in my computer then i again pause them so this means that for example if i pause all this for example i can pause them uh, within five uh, five weeks you see now it's downloading and it's on five fifth so which means that if i uh, i pause these ones for example, I post th this one is within five weeks. So which this means that any internet connection I am going to be connecting there is not going to be consumed by those apps that I'm not seeing. It is going to be only used by uh, what I'm going to be using it, by the software that I'm going to be using it. It is also going to be uh, used by the internet. If it's a browser, it's a browser. If it is a YouTube video that I'm watching, it's going to be using, uh, being used by the video that I'm going to be using. So you can be coming here to uh, advanced options and if you come to the advanced options you can see a uh, receive update from other products also here now depends on now the download over method connections here that that charges may apply if it's now you, you are now other under a uh, method connections now which means that that are going to be applying and also require uh, notify me when a restart is required to finish uploading so so this is also likely to be happening for the some uh, computers uh, for those who are not aware of this because they can be uh, restating when you are connected to the internet because it has automatically updated itself and after the update are finished you see your computer is restarting automatically without any kind of notifications or it will show you now uh, some notification here that it is going to be uh, wanting to be restarting and you can be deciding to restarting it so that is uh, all about why you want to be watching so now uh, what uh, I recommend you to be able to reduce the internet uh, is that now you have to be able uh, to manage uh, the updates, how the updates are going to be uh, working on your computer. Either you can be passing here through the advanced options. If you come to advanced options, you can be able to track everything. Also, you can be able to see everything in your computer. But also, I advise you to be uh, pausing it here. And also, you see now, I have paused it for uh, the dates. You see now, it is paused until 7th of, uh, October 2023, which means uh, my computer from this uh, time to that time, it will be using uh, the internet in a manageable way. Uh, by that time, I can decide, for example, to be updating itself, uh, but I have planned it. But within this time, I can be able to use the internet. Maybe I can be tethering my phone on that. If I tether it on that, it is going to be working well because there is no nothing which is going to be consuming uh, my internet. I cannot receive any recommendation uh, telling me to, for example, to install the given kind of Windows, for example, to install the given kind of software, to update the given kind of software in my computer. I'm going to be using uh, the softwares in a stable way without additional charges or data charges or internet charges uh, from the apps which are, are going to be updating themselves. So, but I can be taking the time for myself and update uh, my whole computer well, like one day. And after that, I even again pause them to avoid that tomorrow or next tomorrow i can connect my internet and it's going to be consumed by this without uh without also knowing that so this is how we can be doing this uh, the best option to be managing the, your internet is that you pause that or updates pause update in the meantime so that you will be using the internet for the only purpose you want to be using on your computer either browser either watching youtube video either doing another activity downloading maybe app but you're not also going to be using other internet behind that you are not aware of if you use this one it's going to be helpful for you for, thank you for watching this video remember to like this video subscribe if you have any issue also if you have any question uh, also remember to leave it in the comment section also uh, thank you for watching this video.